Hey guys, my name is Stephen Beecham, and here's what's happening this week on CNET's Crave Block. Now you can play with your cat from the safety of your computer at work. The iPad Companion Home Play System. Wait, 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 wait. Can we stop naming products with an I in the beginning? Isn't that played out? Okay, anyhow, the iPet Home Companion is a way to virtually connect with your pets and interact with them from anywhere. The iPet Companion has already been installed in animal shelters throughout the country, giving online visitors a way to interact and play with the animals in the shelter. Well, now there is a system for pet owners. The iPet Home Play version comes with a robotic camera, an outlet adapter, a wireless controller, and a pet toy, allowing you to connect with your pet visually and physically from anywhere on the planet. You can add additional toys to your outlet adapter as well. The online application can be shared with your friends and family so others can monitor and keep your pet company while you're unavailable. And it's not limited to pets only. The iPad controller and outlet adapter can be used to control other electronics throughout the house, like this baby's mobile, for example. The iPad Home Companion is currently raising funds on Kickstarter and can be yours for a pledge price of $149. Now you can 3D print your very own Edward Snowden bust on Thingiverse.com. Snowden's bust gained national attention in April when a group of artists installed Edward Snowden's likeness in Fort Greene Park in Brooklyn, New York. The bust was later removed by authorities but inspired something and now the bust lives on on the internet. The Edward Snowden bust is an 8-inch replica of the original sculpture that was called Prison Ship Martyrs Monument 2.0 AKA the Snowden statue. Beginning May 20th, you can order a fresh pizza from Domino's by simply tweeting a pizza emoji to Domino's or using the hashtag easy order. In order to do this, you need to do two things. First, you need to set up an online Domino's pizza profile because who doesn't already have one? And then choose an easy order pizza choice like large pepperoni. Once you're all set up, all you have to do is tweet to Domino's and a pizza will magically be delivered to your house. It's actually really good. Mm. The Wallet Drone claims to be the smallest quadcopter in the world. Robert Morrison, founder of Access Drone, showed off the tiny quadcopter that actually fits inside a wallet-sized case that is both the controller and the mobile recharging station for the Wallet Drone. The quadcopter measures 1.57 inches by 1.57 inches and fits snugly inside the Wallet Drone case, which uses four AA batteries to recharge the drone on the go. The Wallet Drone also comes equipped with a USB cable for charging. The controller fits easily in your pocket, thus the name the Wallet Drone, and the quadcopters have a flying time of about 7 minutes on a 20 minute charge. The tiny quadcopter is capable of doing flips and aerial stunts in trick mode and looks like a large insect when it's in the air. The Wallet Drone can be yours this summer for a $40 pledge on Indiegogo. Alright guys, that's the show. Thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find all these news stories at CNET's Crave blog at crave.cnet.com. Make sure you follow Crave on Twitter at Crave and check out this week's Crave giveaway. This week's Crave giveaway is a Move Fitness wearable. The Move Fitness band doesn't just track steps and calories, it gives real-time coaching. If you're lucky, you could get one for free. Go to the blog and enter to win. Meet Sally. Hello, what can I do for you today? The help you've always wanted. She is faster, stronger, more capable than ever before. Sally is part of your family, a teacher, a helper, a friend. New generation Persona Synthetics, closer to humans than ever before.